This is Yusuf at my channel, and oh, this video is gonna bring out some, <laughs> some pro probably some strange comments, but um, Bohemian Grove. Um, if you don't know about it, Alex Jones went in there. Oh, gotta be like ten years ago now or something. Um, I saw the video way too long time ago, at least seven years ago. Um, and they have the cremation of care ceremony, and there's this big stone owl, and there's owls all over it, all over the place. It's extremely secretive. They'll arrest anybody who goes near there. Um, it's heads of state um, from everywhere from around the world. Uh, I think like one of the chancellors of Germany or so, it's somebody, some German official was like, "Yeah, it's a it's a nice place to go. I've been to many pagan druidic places, and this is this is one of the better ones," which was kind of odd. <coughs> but Alex Jones makes the connection that. The cremation of care, uh, it's a sacrifice, and it, it's a sacrifice and effigy of a human being. Some people say there were real human beings that were sacrificed there. Um, it's been going on since 1880. A lot of the heads of state go there. But they say, oh, he says it's Moloch, the ancient uh, god that uh, the Canaanites used to sacrifice children to. Um, just to burn them, cremate them. Kind of funny, because it's when I made the cremation video, I went and rewatched it, except like that, and it looked ridiculous in that. And, um, oh, also I had to check the comments. Uh, <coughs> but, yeah, they, they brought up all this cremation of care stuff, and you have all these wacko ideas. But there's no... There's nothing before Alex Jones stating that uh, Moloch is the owl. It wasn't uh, had anything to do with owls before he actually made the video. It's sometimes Moloch is depicted as a bronze bull, um, but I think that's that. This, well, I know the carvings of that is from the Middle Ages. I don't know if we have anything more on Moloch than from the Bible. Just like Dagon, uh, Dagon being a fish god, no, that that was no. Five hundred years ago, somebody made an image, and I don't even know if this is that long ago of um, of like uh, a guy with a long beard, a Syrian-looking guy, and then the bottom half of him was a fish, like a mosaic. Um, at least look like that, but, uh, yeah, I just think that's, I think it's creepy what they do back there, and if, I don't know, again, all the shootings that happen in America, all the people going crazy and massacring people, like the dude in the Batman premiere, all this stuff, why not just get together with other crazy people and just go take up people like Henry Kissinger, who's a war criminal, I mean, they, out of all the people you could shoot up, why not just end a lot of the world's problems and do that there. As for it being Moloch, um, yeah, an owl connected to Moloch, I've, that's, no, that started with Alex Jones saying that. Um, burning a human being in effigy, that's creepy enough. Um, I guess it started out being some freaky weird place that a bunch of poets and weirdos could go to, and then now it's like heads of state and costs a lot of money. Um, yeah, I don't know. I was saying that Groucho Marx uh, said, he said, I'd never be a part of an organization that would have me as a member. Um, but, uh, yeah. And then people start talking about the Bilderberg and Trilateral, trilateral Commission and, uh, Council on Foreign Relate, Foreign Affairs and all this other weird stuff. 
Um, as for those things, I don't know. Same thing with skull and bones and all this stuff. I have... Well, nobody really has any idea on a lot of this stuff, but... Yeah, Moloch. Uh, unless there's some find in ancient archaeology, I don't think people can connect him to an owl. Um, unless you find an actual stone owl from... What? Over 4,000 years ago. It says Moloch, the god, the owl god of the Canaanites, who we sacrifice children to. I don't know what connection people are going to because owls are creepy. I don't know, or they were, you know, they'll have them in. It's like cartoonish around Halloween where you have the owl and the witch and the black cat. And yeah, I don't. It, no. As Dagon being a god of the sea, um, that was much later. It was, I mean, way too late. It wasn't like, oh, it was 4,000 years ago and this was, you know, just 100 years after. No, this is stuff that was um, from the Middle Ages or the Renaissance or the Enlightenment or people thinking about what this is. Now, H.P. Lovecraft's Dagon is awesome. That's pretty cool. Uh, and the Shadows Over Innsmouth. I thought that stuff was cool. Uh, but, yeah. I don't see the big stone owl being Moloch. It's possible that they think he is, that they think that's Moloch or whatever. Um, even though nobody except Alex Jones has said that. Uh, and that they're burning... Uh, human in effigy there, um, so that would correspond, that would be, okay, yeah, they're burning a human being to Moloch, and I have no modern scholars say, oh, well, passing a fire, child through the fire, that just means, you know, um, it was kind of like baptism, they would, they would, they would go through the fire unharmed, no, no, I don't buy that, that was human sacrifice, um, and, yeah, I, yeah, there's, I don't see any connection to Moloch, unless any, unless, like, Henry Kissinger, or, well, actually, I wouldn't believe a word that comes out of his mouth, but, I don't know, Dick Cheney or George Bush, again, both idiots, but, probably less evil than Henry Kissinger, um, yeah, I know, less evil than Dick Cheney, you know, or more evil than Dick Cheney, <laughs> you know, shocking, um, but, uh, yeah, Big Stone Owl is not Moloch, yeah, I agree, they're all idiots, and a lot of them should be behind bars, or in the Hague, or something like that, but, no, not Moloch, not Dagon, uh, not Astroth, uh, not Baal. Well, nah, Baal is Lord, so Baal of some kind. But, yeah. It's creepy. Seems to be pagan. So, yeah. I was interested in it before, because I like weird, crazy stuff, like Anatoly Fomenko and all that garbage. Um... But, yeah, this is something that, I'm going to say it doesn't hold my interest, but then I'm going to go and watch, like, 15, 16 videos on it or something. <laughs> no, i got to work today. All right. Take it easy. Peace to you. May God save Serbia and Syria. Save Syria from the crazy media, the insurgents, and um, NATO and the U.S. Uh, sucks that too much pressure. Russia should push back. Russia should know America's not going to do shit right now. Freaking Obama. Like the worst fucking... I, yeah, I know I voted for him. I voted for him, but fuck Obama. Um, piece of shit. Garbage. Worst fucking president. Um, yeah. Fuck Obama. I guess I'll end the talk on cremation of care with fuck Obama. Evil motherfucker. All right, take it easy.
these two may God save Serbia and Syria from I don't know the Islamists and the Western world since now hey US and NATO are working with you know Mujahideen I don't know, I, 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 I don't know maybe I'm going crazy but I think thought we fought a war against them in Afghanistan and Iraq and okay yeah the enemy of my enemy does not make that your friend I'm gonna stop this here anyways take it easy Moloch is not an owl never has been